Hey guys, today we're going to be playing around with the brand new shades that By Terry has come out with for their Brightening CC Serum. I'm very excited for these. They came out with four new shades, uh, which is in addition to four existing shades. And as you guys know, I am a huge, huge fan of their Sunny Flash shade, which is this one. I like wearing it in the summer when I have a little bit of color, a little bit of tan. It just adds like a really lovely bronzy glow. If I'm feeling pale, this is also really nice. It's a little bit deep for me, which was why I was very excited for these new shades. So uh, what I'm going to do today is, uh, you know, show you the new shades, uh, swatch the new shades alongside the old shades and, or existing shades, I should say. I shouldn't call them old. <laughs> existing shades. And I am completely bare skinned. I just have skincare on. And what I wanna do is put each of the new shades on my skin as if I were to wear it as a primer or as if I was gonna wear it alone. Um, and I think that will just give you like the best sense of the actual shade. Um, it's how I like to wear the Sunny Flash. So I'm really kind of selfishly wondering if there is one in there, and I think there is, that is just like a light version of this, one that isn't quite so <laughs> bronze goddess. Um, so let me go ahead and start by showing you the new shades. So here's the box packaging, if you're curious. Nothing out of the ordinary there. And then here is uh, the full size bottle. So I have a lot of these like deluxe sample or bottles that came with in like a gift set or something like that. So I have actually in the existing shades, I have them like all different. <laughs> all different sizes. But anyway, this is like the standard brightening CC serum size. And this is one fluid ounce, it's 30 mils. So this is the lightest of the new shades. And this is shade 2.25 and it's called Ivory Light. And I will show you swatches of these as well, but I'll just show you uh, what the shades are and their names. So here's 2.5 Nude Glow. And you can see this one has like a little bit of a light, light nude kind of tint to it. And then next we have shade 2.75 Peach Glow. And this has a really beautiful, hoping you can see it in the bottle, maybe over here, that like metallic kind of sheen to it, pearly sheen to it. It looks almost pink in the bottle. So very excited to see what that looks like on the skin. And finally, we have shade number five, which is called Sienna Light. And this one is like a warmer version of Sunny Flash. And the kind of like metallic sheen in these brightening CC serums is so subtle. It's not like there's little flecks of micro glitter in your skin or whatever. It really just gives your skin like a pearly kind of finish and I love it. So why don't we start with uh, some swatches? So I swatched all four of these, but alongside the existing four shades. So the existing four shades were just numbered one, two, three, and four. And so I think that they numbered these to kind of go in order. So that's how I swatched them. So here's just a shot of my arm with the Brightening CC serums, just like dropped on my arm. I haven't like spread them out yet. Once I spread them out, they get kind of sheer. So I just wanted you to get a sense of the actual shade first before I kind of smeared them down. And here is my arm with them actually smeared down. So here are the actual swatches. So first we have number one, which is Immaculate Light, and that is an existing shade. Number two is, I believe it's called Rosy Glow, and this one is uh, almost like a white kind of shade and has like an iridescent kind of like pink to it. And then here are some of the newer shades. So next we have 2.25, which is Ivory Light. Then we have 2.5, which is Nude Glow. And then we have 2.75, which is Peach Glow. And then we're back to one of the older shades, which is number three, Apricot Glow. And then we have number four, which is Sunny Flash. And then finally, we have one of the newer shades, number five, Sienna Light. All right, so I'm really excited to get these on my face. I'm gonna start with 2.25 Ivory Light. And you can really use these, you know, any which way you want. Like I said, I personally prefer using these two shades, the Apricot Glow and the Sunny Flash kind of on their own. They do a really lovely kind of like perfecting to your face, to your complexion, um, but you can add it to your foundation if you wanna add a little bit of a, a tint of color. Um, if you wanna add a little bit of glow to foundation, you can use some of these like lighter shades as like a liquid highlight if you want. So they're very, very versatile. Um, but like I said, I wanna see how they look on my skin just by themselves all over. And I do think that'll give you guys um, the best sense of them as well. So. Here is Nude Light, and I just pumped out just one pump. 
And they do have that uh, By Terry rose scent, which I don't mind. But if you do not like rose fragrance, you're not going to like this. I'm just going to pump out another pump. And what's nice about these two is that they are serums, so they feel really, really great on the skin. They're not too heavy. They're not like overly moisturizing or anything like that. I do think that they would work for a lot of different skin types. I have very dry skin, so any sort of additional, additional moisture is welcome. So there is Ivory Light 2.25 all over my face. I think this is actually a good match to my neck because I do think it kind of lightened up in a very, very faint, subtle way, but I do think it kind of lightened up my skin because this is quite pale for me. Um, and my neck is uh, considerably paler than my face naturally. So I do think this is a really nice match for my neck. Um, I, I don't know, I tend to like something just a little bit deeper for my face, just to kind of keep, I know people like to match their neck, but I feel like that always looks so like, it actually looks kind of odd to me because most people's faces are tanner <laughs> than their necks. Um, so anyway, this is Ivory Light. I think I would probably end up using this as uh, maybe in the winter time or um, as like a liquid highlighter or mixing it in with a foundation that's maybe just a tinge too deep for me. All right, so I'm gonna take this off and I'll be right back. All right, next up, we are gonna try 2.5 Nude Glow. And this is the one I have to admit, I'm most excited for because I think this is like the one that I'd be able to wear every day as a base, as a primer, et cetera, et cetera. So I'm gonna start by pumping out one pump and let's just apply this to the bottom half of my face. Oh, this feels so incredible too. Oh yeah, this is the one. <laughs> this is so great. And I feel like now that I have Nude Glow, um, I can kind of mix it in with the Sunny Flash if I want something a little bit deeper, but not quite this bronzy. Ah, oh, this is, this is so, so great. By the way, I got all of these from Beautylish, just FYI. So they are available there now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and pump one more pump and apply to my forehead here. Oh, do you see that sheen? Isn't that gorgeous? And what I love about this sheen is it doesn't look, I don't think, it looks greasy or oily. You just have this beautiful pearlescent like finish to your skin. So beautiful. Yes, Nude Glow. You're the one for me. So if you use me as a shade reference and you are looking for something that's just like, you could use it as a base or whatever, Nude Glow is the one for sure. Okay, I'm so excited. All right, let me take this off and we'll move on to 2.75 Peach Glow. All right, fre freshly cleansed skin. Let's do this again. Uh, 2.75 Peach Glow. So I'm gonna shake this up. You definitely wanna shake these up. Again, I'm gonna pump out one pump. Let's see how this looks on the skin. Definitely very brightening. All right, there is Peach Glow on. Wow, that looks really nice too. It's so interesting. I feel like this one looks the most natural on my skin so far. What do you guys think? I feel like this is the most undetectable. I use the same amount. I use two pumps, one down here, one on my forehead. Um, but I felt like I could see this. This was like a little bit... I don't know, I, and I was holding up the nude glow, sorry. <laughs> um, it was almost, it almost felt like I had on like a, like a very, 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 very light coverage sort of base product. Where this, I don't feel like there's really much coverage at all, but I feel like this would be so much more obvious on my skin. Wow, it's really pretty. I feel like it's really brightened up my complexion. Huh, okay. Maybe this one is more of an everyday. That's so interesting. So, so interesting. Here, let me get up close here. Yeah, I mean, I think you can see like a little bit of the pinkiness going on, but I think because I have uh, like cooler skin tone here, obviously my forehead is not very cool anymore, but my, um, like my natural skin tone is very, very cool toned. My forehead is just from all the years of like sun exposure it's not cool anymore. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is I feel like it's like kind of bringing out the coolness 
in my skin tone, especially here where I feel like I'm very neutral. You know, I'm going from the warm to the cool. I'm very neutral around this part of my face. Huh. Wow, that's really pretty. <laughs> really, really pretty. I'm surprised, I have to say. Wow, I'm even more excited to try this very deep sienna light on because this one I was like, it's probably going to look crazy on me, but this may look very nice too. Okay, let me take this off and we'll put this one on. Okay, and last but not least, sienna light. Oh, I should let my face calm down a little bit. I just put moisturizer back on. Let me let my skin calm down because <laughs> I don't want the redness in my skin to like alter the appearance of this. One moment, please. Okay. All right, my complexion is, it has calmed down. So, Sienna Light. Ooh. Yeah, you can see how deep this is for my skin tone. This is perfect though, if you have a medium to deeper skin tone that's uh, on the warm side. Do you see that I can't even get into my hairline here? Wow, do I look tan. My goodness. And that uh, slight kind of ready, warm undertone really gives me like a sunburnt look versus the sunny flash, which is more of just like a bronze goddess. This definitely makes me look like I've been out in the sun all summer, all summer. Definitely too deep, <laughs> definitely too deep for my skin tone. But this actually, I'm looking at it, this would be great as a blush by itself or maybe used strategically in the summertime as like a bronzer, like you know, putting it where I would bronze because I do like this kind of like sunburnt tone to it. But if you have like a deeper skin tone with maybe like a like a red undertone, this, I think this would be great if you want like a pearlescent sheen to your skin. I think this would be perfect. All right, so that is it for this video. I just wanted to try on these four new brightening CC serums from by Terry. I'm so excited. I am very, very excited for Nude Glow and Peach Glow. These two, these two, yeah, these two are the ones for me. And of course the uh, Ivory Light 2.25. If you have a lighter skin tone than I do or one that is much cooler, I think this is perfect for you. Uh, and we just talked about Sienna Light. So I will leave a link down below in my description box where you can purchase these. And that's it. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe down below if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video.